Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to more cyberpunk. My name is Raven from the sky. Now let's do this. Sit. You do not look so bad. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. Why'd you help me anyway? I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and Yorino Varasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. I've been thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. You just answered your own question. Just answered your own question about where Evelyn is. Long gone. Why do you believe she could help you remove the chip? Does a corporation help her? B? Got no clue. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic. Had a large chunk of classified info. An enigma to be sure. But she showed that slyness he get in corporal agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slyness you speak of. You got tossed out, lumped with the outcasts, easily. Or have you forgotten? <sighs> Is that all? Really should be going. Wait. Yorino Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice in Night City. I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorino to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here. And I am a fugitive. I am hunted. So what? We stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people in a neutral location. Certain. Procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics, yep. Politics. Yep. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist, thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true, he's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka, betrayed it. Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you, Fucking Saka scums everywhere. Hey, I was listening to that. Shut up. Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. Hmm. At least one of you's got some fucking sense.
Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. Get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes. I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. Ah. There's just honor, I believe. Your noble Arasaka would agree, I'm sure. The Paka woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, he's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats will squeal when hanging by their tails. Yep. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place, the club called the Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the queen of fixers there, Rogue. She take you for a suit? No, she saw me as Saburo-sama's killer. Rogue's well informed, gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. The old man is choosy, expensive, and rude. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends, call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka is still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you got some nerve. First you had to kill me, now you want to be my pal. Make it like nothing happened. You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dickwipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back. Looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. You're the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know, Rogue. What do I say to her? Got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seeing your memories, gross. Rogue will dance to any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. See? 
that you? Shit. I thought you were... gone. Listen, need to find Evelyn. I really don't want to talk about her. You know where she is? what I just say? Drop it. I won't tell you again. Can we meet? Let's meet, please. What now? You at Lizzie's? Hey, look. Would you look at that? You see it too, right? Either gone completely whacked or I'm having a mystical moment. What's that chick's name? The one with the hair? Misty? Yeah, more likely a neuron misfire for Victor to check out. Or maybe I ask them both. You blind? City? You're so eager for four years of the same? You say so. Stand here. The sun is down, but I hope you're still up. Is it a mirage? A hologram? No, my friends. It's clear open sky. What a problem? But don't take it from me. Get out there and enjoy the sun. Watch it. Hey, haven't I seen you here before? Got a good memory for faces. Here for a good time. Need to talk to Punch and Judy. She in her den? Yep. Take the stairs down. I'll let Judy know you're coming. My, what a sweet little face you have. Every 
joy toy you need to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? You so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guest. Sus, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. You just don't give up, do you? Nope. Got nothing more to say to each other. Thought I... Moxes and nomads don't seem so different. Both seem to yammer a lot about community. Solidarity. Classic dilemma. What comes first? Family or the outside this world? This is a club. Nobody cares about your lofty world views. Listen. Have you seen Evelyn? Need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist. Can you just answer my question? I'm trying to find Evelyn. That's all you need to know. Better start looking then. Black. Sounds to me like you two talk. Seem to know how the heist went. Meaning you did talk to her. I know how you fucked up. Got all your Doombas killed like a real pro. Caught some lead myself, too. Boo hoo. Occupational hazard for you, Mercs. Sure, I took a risk. We all did. But it was Evelyn who gave it to us in the first place. She knew what this was from the start. Fine. Looks like we're all in this piss pot together. But you're desperate. Writing's on your face. Excuse me? I came here with a simple question. You're the one making me desperate if I am. Maybe instead of judging, you could just tell me where she is. All right, enough. Get lost. You care so much. Find clouds. Look there. And where's clouds? Sig case on my desk's got the address. Just take it and go. Mega Tower. Luxurious. Evelyn's there. You know this. Or are you guessing? Saw it in the tarot. Now ghosts before I call the girls. The way I see it, only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. Provides 330% of recommended daily violence. I missed this time. Enlighten me. Brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. Our sock and the tiger claws are in bed together. Go figure. Every corp plays dirty. Except the streets are more than that. They're filth. So the corpse leave it to the gang. Suits collars and gets soiled. Surprised? No, I mean, if Evelyn wanted to disappear, especially from Arasaka, she could have done better. This whole situation's bent over, cheeks spread wide. I think Judy's lying. Why? A little something called intuition, V. Ever heard of it? Oh, so what you meant to say was you're full of shit. Got it. Scientists from Biodyne Systems have announced a breakthrough in the fight against multiple sclerosis. So hold on. You take the whole of the stream all the whole, and then that's it. That's it. Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? All right, let's do this. 
This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Afterlife. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. matches interesting is that normal or who can say what is normal you're clearly a unique person with unique tastes our system can handle it so who will it be angel or sky looking for evelyn parker she work here hmm give me a moment Evelyn's not available at this time. Need to see her. It's important. The algorithm knows best. Trust me, it will choose a doll that will thrill you. Our dolls can change their hair and eye color in real time to look just as you wish. I just want to talk to her, that's all. Please, no need for concern. Your doll will talk to you about anything you wish. Huh. I'm sorry. Did she finally say anything useful? Fuck the menu. Let's ditch this waitress and take our special order to the chef, point blank. So who will it be? Angel or meaning, Sky? Meaning you go in as a customer, keep a low profile. They want to keep their cards close, fine. We'll play our own game. I think an angel looks good. I couldn't have chosen better myself. Now for the payment. And you'll venture into the clouds. There you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Angel awaits you in booth six. Disconnect, please. Is that it? <clears throat> we have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. Only two willing to spread their legs Thank for you. you. Sad. Hope you enjoy your stay. Go eat a dick, Johnny. Guess that makes you a real deviant. Would have had more choices if I didn't have a certain brain parasite. you do best I know that you're dying how'd you know I'm dying deep inside you fear this cower before it so what if I do well, why do you care of all the voices in your head the loudest is that calling for help that's why you're here look around tell me what you see There's something in the mirrors. 
Way back. It's a projection. Your inner landscape. Just what I needed. Therapy with a robo-hooker. I'm not going to analyze you. I won't play any tricks. My sole aim is to fulfill your greatest need. Listen, I'm looking for someone who worked here. Evelyn Parker. Know her? Know where she is? You must see the big picture. You focus too much on details, minor ones, like Evelyn. Please don't act like you know me. I just want some answers. But are you asking the right questions? How can you change what has already happened? What did you mean, happened? Know something I don't? What happened to you? What you keep inside and never reveal? to anyone and that is come now you know snuffed it once and I'm gonna have to do it all over again got no idea how to stop it there happy you wish to leave something behind a piece of yourself that's why this all began you wish to be remembered. Yeah. Wanted to reach the top. Be someone. Still do. But seems like that might not happen anymore. Still, if I gotta die, I wanna go down in history. Fuck it, even a footnote to do. And after that? Do you think death is a disappearing act followed by exactly nothing? People I've lost live on in my thoughts. And that's what I'll be. A memory. Or just some stranger's voice in my own body. Yapping away. Mm, no longer part of the world. You will still have an impact there. So you believe death is not the end after all? Reassuring. I think I might just be afraid. So I imagine these things to distract myself from the thought of the void. If what I saw before is any indication where. You are sensitive. That does not make you weak. Try to suppress your emotions, and you'll drown. So, where do we go from here? This is the part where I tell you what you must do. Oh, uh, okay. Be my guest. You've never backed down from anything, so don't stop now. Not one step backwards. In this city, people die on their way to the corner store for a scop pop. But that threat's never stopped you. You dive into the middle of it all. Always have. Things are moving way too fast. Around me, without me. I... I can't keep up. A minor delusion. The truth is, we and our paths are braided. Never ending. Ever transforming. Not being, but becoming. And what's happening inside you, it could change the world. Listen, V. Never look back. If you must kill, kill. If you must burn all the world to the ground, then let it burn, okay? Thanks for this. I... I don't want to go out there. No one ever does. But eventually, we all must. Afterlife. What? What happened? You interrupted the session? Did I do something wrong? W were you not satisfied? Evelyn Parker. What do you know about her? Wait just a sec. That's not how this works. You can't ask me about the dollhouse or anything like that. I could get in serious trouble. 
Go, please, just go. You gotta help me, please. I'm no threat, and she could be in trouble. Just want to talk to her, find out if she's okay. Look, I barely knew her, and I have no clue where she is. Nobody came looking for her. Nothing out of the ordinary happened. There was an incident with a client. I don't know the specifics. One doesn't ask about these things around here. Tom might know. He and Evelyn were close. Go ask him. And please leave me alone. Tom, who's he? Friend of Evelyn's. Wasn't a free moment they weren't together. Where'll I find him? He's a doll here. Works the VIP area, booth two. Thanks. Shh. Don't ask for me again. Ever. Not bad. Buddy. I can't get in? What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week! You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh, yes, I am! Damn it. What now? Oh, fuck you myself! Ooh, that was close. What do you want? No, don't shoot me. Don't... Relax, you're not in trouble. Just want to talk for a little. Where's Evelyn? Need to talk to her urgently. It's important. Are you mad at her or something? No. Know where she is or not. Uh, she's not here. 
Tried calling her more than once, no answer. Heard she was chipping a new faceplate in a clinic in Osaka. No, no, Oslo. That was it. Osaka or Oslo? Which is it? Uh, Oslo. Yeah, yeah, definitely Oslo. Evelyn tell you personally she was going away? Um, no, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Woodman, who is he? Mr. Forrest, but we all call him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest then. Who is he? Um, he's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Could it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges in these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing. What do you want? Chill. Keep calm. I'm looking for a girl. Cab. Interesting word. 
third choice for someone who plowed through massacring all along the way? Things got out of hand, I'll admit. But cooperate, and no one else will get hurt. I don't negotiate with terrorists. Aren't you the king of fuck-ups? You're not helping. Now what? Hell, why don't you just scan the truth from his gray, lifeless hey, eyes? Or scour his cop? That just might work. Sold her off to a ripper. Ship was busted. Could have sent her to get it patched up. A ripper named Fingers in a back alley for hookers. Sounds like a Joy Toy's wet dream. Their purse could have had more than one. All the shits in it, though. Must have left in a hurry. Where you got to, Come out alone. We won't hurt you. I promise. I 
I really don't feel like this today. Show yourself. Pistols ain't no joke. to return hey I don't know anything I just work here hey I don't know anything I just work here work back there. Ever thought of applying for the diplomatic corps? You think Fingers got her? I think we'll find her there. V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now. Ladies and gentlemen, thanks for watching. My name is Raven from the Sky. If you enjoyed the episode, drop a like and subscribe to the channel to see if you grow. Take care and I'll catch you guys in the next episode. Peace out.